Well, Bo Coffrin joining us and your daughter, Abigail. Yes. The Lunchbox Dad, you have a website and a blog. It's thelunchboxdad.com. It's yes. amazing what you've been doing with her school lunches, and it's all healthy, promoting healthy eating habits, right? Right, yeah. I try and make everything really healthy, fat-free, cream cheese, as much as possible. Of course, you got to sneak a little bit of sweet stuff a little, in. A little treats. Okay, yeah. so last hour, we did this one right here. We did the little snowman. Right, we did winter snowman. The winter snowman. This hour, we're going to do this, the Grinch who stole Christmas. Right, obviously a classic. So it looks uh, looks really detailed, looks really difficult, but it's easy. Any parent could do it. Okay, so let's start with this, and then, uh, so what's the first thing you're going to start with? I see you have so, a little lettuce. Right, so we got some lettuce. I like to use lettuce as background because it's filler. And then you have uh, bread and cream cheese right there, as you can see. And so uh, lettuce is also colorful, so it stands out from the mm -hmm. background. Do you, eat the, do you eat the lettuce, Abigail? Oh, you don't? Oh, she does Maybe not. she'll be brave one day and eat it. <laughs> one day she'll eat it, I'm sure. Okay, so what's so, the next thing so that you great. do? So next thing, we are going to take the apple face and put it on here. Now, all I used was food coloring marker, which you can get online, and just uh, sketched a face. I looked it up online. Printable coloring sheets are great to copy from. And so that's how you can get, get super creative. Right, and so then we have some eyes. This is just cheddar cheese. Cheddar cheese, you cut the little eyes out. Right. So cute. Really easy if you have a nice a knife and cheese you can do it there okay. you go there's the face and last but not least you can't, can't forget the hat you got to have the santa hat and oh and that's made there. out of bread it's like it's a peanut butter and jelly right. sandwich so that is a peanut butter and jelly sandwich she loves oh. those and so i go with it and they're they're easy to do easy to decorate and so the last finishing touches we want to put on this abby has been practicing is if you guys want to put on some yogurt covered raisins Ooh. and some raisins oh. and just How drop cute. Them around Okay, so we have some other ones that you've done that we want to show. Last hour, we showed really creative ones. This hour, even more creative. This is a Kung Fu Panda one that you did. Take a look at this. What is this made out of? So this is Abby's favorite. This is just, once again, a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. <laughs> I actually cut out the eyes and nose and ears out of Nori, which is dried seaweed that you can get at any grocery uh -huh. store, like all this stuff. And then there's uh, some uh, little pasta in the background with some blueberries and some peas. So, so vegetables, cute. pasta. Wow. And it's basically, actually, that was leftovers from the night before. Oh, my God. Gosh, so oh awesome. Gosh. Can I have you make my daughter's meals? <laughs> I know. Can you, can you believe <laughs> having it? I got a rice cake in my lunchbox for my mom. Rice cake. Here, look at this. Hello Kitty. This is so, so cute. So cute. And it, it this take you like 30 minutes to do. About 30 minutes. This was actually the first one that I did, and this was her, for her first Monday of school. I make one every Monday, and uh, something I post a little special. Something special. I just try. It helps me connect oh, with her. Oh, I love this. My little pony. <laughs> this is yeah. Awesome. Yes. What? I like apple too. Oh, you yeah, do? Yeah, my little pony's name is Applejack. She was asking for that one for weeks, so I, I ended up doing that one. And that's so just cute. that's just cheese and dried mango and some goldfish crackers and craisins how and a little her, bit of cream how cheese. How do her classmates yeah. react? Are they, are they jealous at yeah. school? What do they say? I, you know, I'm not around for her lunchtime, but she says they think that uh, they're Abigail, cute. Abigail, are they jealous when you open your lunchbox and they see what you get? Yeah. What do they say? What, what do they say? What do your uh, friends say to you? It's cool. <laughs> it's cool. And you love it, huh? You just love to eat it? She likes decorating, and it's a surprise for her. And I, I feel like one of the best things that I that I do each uh, time is I write a note to her telling her that I love her oh, and uh, that I'm thinking about her. Come on. I know what you're, your wife is here. We can't show her on camera. Don't do it. Don't do it. But she must be so lucky to have a dad like you and a great husband. Oh, I love what you. you're doing. It's the lunchboxdad.com. So Check out the blog. Every Monday there's a new posting. You can get creative with your lunches and eat healthy. And I'm on Pinterest, the Lunchbox Dad, and Twitter at Lunchbox Dad. Okay, you're like the best dad in the world. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to start following you. Oh, man. Awesome. Stuffy. All right, ladies, back over to you. Lunchboxdad.com. Thanks, Fantastic. Team. Thanks so much. Very